guys, so today what I'm going to be showing you is my basic kind of look that I do every single day almost, unless there's like a special occasion or if I have more time to do something different. But this is just like a basic thing that I do every day. So let's get started. Oh, and I already did my foundation and all of that, and if you want to see how I do that, I will post that video in the description bar. So I start off, all I do is apply my Urban Decay Primer Potion to both my eyes. One at a time. Make sure you rub it all in. Do do do. do, do, do. Next thing I do is I take my L'Oreal Paris 24 Hour Invaluable Eyeshadow in AAA Iced Latte. Don't know if you can see that or not. But yeah, it's just like a pretty color, and I just take it. And I put it on my finger, and I put it all over my eyelid, and then get it like in the crease right here, or like the inner corner of the eye. And to really get it in there, I take this tiny little brush, and I get my brushes from eBay. They're not like great brushes or anything, but yeah. I get right in there, and I get my inner corner. So this is the color I basically use as a base, and then in my inner corners to make it shine. So next thing I do is I take this brush, and it's like a crease shader brush or whatever, and I use my Sephora Moon Baked Palette, Moon Shadow Baked Palette, which I love. I've used it like every single day ever since I got it. It is so amazing. I love it. These are all the colors in it, and the color that I take is just this one. You can see it's different. It's like indented. But I just take that color and I apply it from right here and all over my eye. So that you know, like they're basically the same color. So this is a powder and the other one's a cream and it just sets that. Next thing I do is I take the gold color right here and I apply that to like, sorry I'm looking in the mirror down here, this is all, the viewfinder is horrible, but um, I take it and I put it like from the middle of my eyelid out and then I like put it in the crease. Mm -hmm. And then I do the same with the other eye. Then the next thing I do after I do that is I take this brown color right here. And I take that and I dot it. And I apply it right here and just this like outer little part right there. And I do it to the other eye. And once that's on there, on both eyes, I just blend it out. So I blend it, blend it, blend it. Blend it, blend it, blend it. Why do people make such weird faces when they're doing their makeup? I do. I can't help it. Sorry. After that, I basically just take a brush that I never use with anything and I just get the fallout off my face. Next I do my eyebrows and I take my e.l.f. beauty eye manual and the only thing I like ever use this for is this color right here because it matches my brows like perfectly and I just take that and I fill in my brows to fill in the bald spots. I don't want to look like a bald old man. Yeah, then after that, so my camera died. Whoops. 
so I just had to wait like 20 minutes to get a little bit of charge back in it so I could finish my makeup but anyways so I take this thing and I comb them thing I do is I take this which I got in my eyeliner kit that I got from Sephora that I didn't know if I was going to like any but I love this one and it's almost gone so I'm going to go to the store and buy a new one mm -hmm. don't know why I'm talking like this but anyways take this and I go like this sure I get it both on the top and the bottom and then I do the same thing to the other eye so once that's done I like to like smudge it a little bit up there and then um I don't always do mm -hmm. a like wing I'm, I do it a couple times a week because I usually do this kind of look every day I, I t switch it up a little I add a wing where is that Right here. I just got stuff on my nose because I just smudged it because I smudged it with my finger and it's on my fingers and I just got that on my nose. When I do do the winged eyeliner look thingy, I use my calligraphy liquid eyeliner in Ebony by Hourglass. using it. That will be a different video. But yeah, so after that I like to put on mascara and I have two favorites and sometimes I add the two, sometimes I do either or and sometimes yeah, I do it one on one day, sometimes I do another on the next, sometimes I have them together, but they're both amazing. And that is my box of mascara, and also my one by one by Maybelline, and the one by one looks like this, and the box of looks like this. The Buxom one's from Bear Essentials, if you don't know what Buxom is from, what makeup line, and that's what it's from. And, yeah, so, this isn't the color black, it's black, and this is mm -hmm. very black, intense black. So, yeah, today, which one should I use? I'll use this one, because I've seen a lot of people use this one in their videos, so a lot of people probably already know that one does so I'll just use this one today so yeah like this I just apply that and I do it to the bottom very buildable also and to me it does not clump it looks great and that's what I love by the one by one and this is they separate your lashes wonderfully and they don't clump don't know if you can really see but I'll do the other eye and I'll do a close up
yeah, basically that's it. And the only thing that changes every day is my lip color. I like to change that up. <sighs> um, that doesn't change every day, but I like to change it up. My two favorite ones to wear right now are the Tarte Lip Surgeons and Enchanted. And then, I can't find that one right now. But I, I'm also really loving my, this Clinique one. And it's in the color Blood, mm -hmm. I think. I'm not sure because it's got like this number thing over it. Um, but yeah, but I'm loving that. And I love this because it's like a tinted balm. It's really pretty. And um, also, it, like it's like different on everybody's lips. Like my mom has a more pigment to her lips, so it looks different on hers. On her, it looks more like a raspberry color. On me, it's more like a burgundy color. And I love it. But today, because my family is putting up the Christmas decorations today, I'll be going for a red lip. So I'm going to be using 05 Candy Apple and the Revlon Color Burst. And then over that for gloss, I will be using the Rimmel London Stay Glossy, and this color is <sighs> I don't think it says what color it is, but yeah, it looks like this, and it's red and shimmery. lips. So guys, that's basically my basic um, look that I do every day with the changing up the lip color every day. Um, but yeah, so if you didn't see my foundation routine, go check that out. If you didn't see my morning routine, go check that out. And if you did not see what I do to take all this off at night, go check that out. Thanks for watching my videos. I love you all. And see you later.